Hello world and welcome back to another episode of The Division. This is Wogs. Now today we're going to try doing the um, the directives and stuff in the underground actually because you guys can pause and read all this if you want. Uh, I want to do this because I need to let's see custom operation. Let's do challenging phase one tech so we can get more Phoenix credits and XP. Um, let's go ahead and hit confirm. Hopefully I'm not too uh, low of a level for this, and hopefully this will send out people, or send out to matchmake with people. Alright, we're actually going to just go ahead and matchmake a challenging. I need to, the reason I'm doing this is because I want to find um, a new gun, or at least it's new to me, I'm not sure how long it's been out. A, uh, a gun called The House. It's an SMG, it looks like it's um, kind of like an MP5. You're now entering a safe area. So, uh... I want to go ahead and try to get that because those things were really good. Okay, that's one guy. Hopefully they don't kick me for uh, being lower level because it's been a while. Let's see, I am I'm 275. This guy's 281, 286. So hopefully, um, one, I don't get kicked and two, I don't get my ass kicked because since this is challenging, I'm wondering what he's going to put on any of these things. I'm assuming we're going to want one more person. I don't want to do this with just three. All right, good. So all these guys are higher level than me, which means they know what they're doing. More than I do, I would assume. I would hope. Object successfully located. Warning. Now we're exiting the safe area. Hopefully, like I said, I don't get my butt handed to me. I thought there was a resupply over here. Maybe they don't do that anymore because it's challenging. Well, let's see. And it has been a while since I've played this game, though, I tell you what. I had to tab out for a second because I'm trying to get my audio. Hopefully this isn't too quiet for you guys. Got guys all around me. Alright. Oh god. Martyrdom? What was that? Alright, there we go. Yeah, that was actually pretty quiet. So now the sound should be good for you guys. Sorry for that drastic change. Can they take all that loot? Hopefully not. Hopefully it's shared for all of us. Um, there was actually some right here too. Let's see. I always, I'm that guy who Object takes every located. piece of clothing. I try to have every piece of clothing in like <laughs> every game that I have. I can't remember if that hurts me or not. Alright, let's see. Warning. Hostiles detected. Oh god. Yep. This thing has so much recoil. The mouse pad is not big enough for me to counter it all in one mag. I mean that. 
I just take I just take everything to sell for credits and get for uh, and get like resources and stuff. So I'm not sure if that's what's what you're supposed to do anymore, but it's just what I remember doing. So I just keep doing it. Let's see if we can't find the valve. Get our visibility back. Not it. Let's see. Let's go ahead and do that. Gotta go seek out that guy. Flank around. Where's this switch at? Hope I didn't pass it. Also, why are my teammates all the way, like, over there? Am I just behind? I guess I'm just behind. Now leaving impacted area. Alright, cool, there's a restock down here too. Take that. But yeah, so I'm trying to do this to um, get the house. If any of you guys um, know a better way to try to get it, or if there's like somewhere that drops it, like a higher chance of somewhere that drops it else, somewhere else, then uh, let me know. But as far as I know, this would probably be one of the best ways to get it. Such recoil. Many wow. Wonder how many tiers this is. Cause I don't think that was it. Okay, we got an underground cache. I hope that wasn't all. Oh, yeah, that was it. Knee pads, huh? Okay. Well, let's see if we can't uh, open it from this cache that we just got. That was really fast for challenging. Walk through the doors casually because I'm a mutant. Alert. An agent is now leaving your team. Well, let's see. Alright, let's go ahead and open this cache. Come on. Give me the thing. Or not. That's fine. Ooh, 277 and 270. Alright, those are good. Those are good levels, I think. Lowers just about everything, but not by a whole lot. All right, so let's go ahead. We'll just um, we'll go ahead and dismantle all of that to get more fabric. Cause I heard that the resources are like super important these days. Also got something in the appearance. I got that scarf. Oh, come on. All right. Let's see. These analysts are finding some patterns based on the intel you're bringing back. We got a shit ton of work to do, but we're getting a clearer picture of what we're up against. Keep up the good work. But for God's sake, find some time to take a bath one of these days. Mm -hmm. Also, what is this? Global events. One global event cache.
Always active. Enemies explode after they're killed. Strike behavior plus sustained. Okay. Global event vendor. Well, I can get one of these. 256. Ooh. Ooh, you can get exotics. Okay, so I need to get... I'm almost there. I'm like almost able to buy one of those. What is this? Optimization station. Ooh, what do you do here? Oh my god, that's so much division tech. Wait, whoa. <gasps> Wait. Can you increase your level of things? Select item. Optimizing this item will modify one or more loadouts. I'm going to have to look into this. What is this? So it ups the damage. Oh, all right, I found a game. All right, now let's go see if we can afford to buy this um, this crate right here. This one, 1,500. Yes, we can. All right, let's buy it. All right, let's see if we can get ourselves the house. That's what this whole recording session has been about, is getting the house. So let's see. Please. Please. Warlord. Do I already have that? It sounds familiar. Let me see. Warlord, I do. But it's only 263. So let's look at this guy. I've got all the perks for it. Uh, damage taken reduced uh, when firing. Taken damage is applied when you stop. Applied when stop firing. That sounds stupid, actually. If I'm reading that right, that means basically you can just tank all this damage, and then once you stop firing, it's just gonna add it to you anyway, as if you got, as if you just took that damage when you were shooting anyway. Which, if that's correct, then that's stupid, because it's that's essentially like a useless perk. Um, using the skill improves the handling of your weapon for. 30 or 15 seconds. Killing a target regenerates 35% health. Okay. Well, that looks like it does some good damage. 30.3. Um, Let's look at our other. 28. 28. Hey, that's my highest damage. AK. And I love AKs. Let's take a look at it. Look at that thing. Oh yeah. Sweet. And I got some for you. It's the word no. And don't talk to me. Sweet. I'll have to mod this later and try it out. Alright, well I'm not I'm not disappointed yet until I use it. Hopefully it doesn't uh suck. Well, at least we got something out of it it's kind of cool so now I know I'll just go there for uh, all my stuff so I just gotta grind those purple credits whatever they are but um or I guess hot pink magenta but uh, yeah so thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed if you did enjoy please leave a like it helps out the channel very much leave a comment letting me know if you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more of this if you want to see more of the skirmish and PvP stuff that I did over here that was in the first episode the other day um, if you want to see more of the underground gameplay that I did just before this and then also if you want to see um, more survival and everything so let me know if you want to see any more of this stuff in the division or any other games that you want to see me play if you're new to the channel and you enjoyed the video feel free to hit that subscribe button but only if you want to and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks.